Finding the perfect spot to tie the knot is a big decision, but not as big of a decision as actually deciding to get married. <laughs> you know, you want that wedding day to be the start of a long and happy marriage. Yeah, and there is a place in West Michigan that not only provides the idyllic setting to say those vows, but it's offering a free course for those looking to deepen their relationship, increase their communication, help with a little self-reflection. We've got Jeff and Melissa Rosing. They are the married couple behind mm -hmm. the Black mm -hmm. Sheep Shelter, joining us to share more. Good morning to you. Good morning. morning. Thanks for being here. Thanks for having us. Thank well, you. Let's talk about the sh shelter. Mm -hmm. yes. uh, it's, yeah. Yeah. Strange, strange to use the word shelter because it makes me think of, of something else, <laughs> right? Yes. Yeah. But, but the Black Sheep Shelter is really just gorgeous. It's a great place mm -hmm. to, to get married, right? Thanks. Thanks. Yeah, Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we started in 2020. Um, prior to that, I worked at an organic farm in Holland, directed Eighth Day Farm. And uh, so we grew vegetables for CSA. We transformed a parking lot uh, into a farm and a playground as well. And we loved that work. Most was a social worker in Holland. Uh, we felt like we needed a change, so we bought the property to the 17. Did a lot of mm -hmm. renovations and opened 2020. And mm -hmm. yeah, it's an outdoor wedding venue. We spent a lot of time in the garden there still. And it has a glass house for dancing and a big structure, like a pavilion, where the ceremony and reception people, happened. People are looking at their TVs right now saying, that's where I should have gotten married. <laughs> right? I mean, look at these shots. So cool, so cool. But, but beyond the actual event, let's talk about the other yeah. services you offer, getting people to the big day and beyond. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, one of the things um, we were really excited about, like we, we love being able to help people celebrate a wonderful day with family and friends. Um, and, and so there's a lot that goes into preparation for that. Um, but one of the things that we have been working on for the last year we were excited to be able to share is the marriaging curriculum. And um, basically what it is is something that, um, you know, beyond the wedding day, um, you're able to focus on your relationship. And so it, it's something that we shared for, it's 50 short lessons that people can be able to go through and deepen the relationship. Um, and, and real quickly, real briefly, just talking about the different parts of it. Um, it starts out with some self-reflection, like you said, some, some self-knowledge, like, all right, what, what do I know about myself? And using some different tools and surveys to help with that. And then um, from there, going into more self-awareness, um, looking at a solutions generator, like how can my spouse and I talk and go through some things to be able to um, work through conflict and do it in a healthier way. Um, the fourth part we talk about is the, or the um, uh, building new habits. And um, we talk a lot about James Clear atomic habits in that. Um, so I don't know if you're familiar with that. He really, it, he talks about you don't rise to the level of your goals, you fall to the level of your systems. And so helping people build new habits. Um, sure. And then lastly, it takes a village to support a marriage, even the best of marriages. And so we talk about in that, um, how, how are you connected to community? And so that's what, yeah, this, this marriaging curriculum is. I got a question for you. <laughs> There's so many. Uh, so really my main question is why I mean I, I understand mm. there's so many great venues out there beautiful mm -hmm. places to get married why did you decide to add them what was the mm. what was the spurring incident that made yeah. this cross your mind yeah, yeah. well we, we initially had planned for it just to be for the couples getting married at our wedding venue that were like oh, okay after your wedding we want to do something to not only invest in that but to help invest in your marriage um, and so that was the driving force and so it was over a year ago Jeff and I started to do some research and delve in and um, listen to a bunch of podcasts and read books and um, a lot of discussion. And we realized that we were learning a ton and we've been married 20 years. And so we just realized, you know, whatever stage you're at in your marriage, um, whether you're married with no kids or if you have young kids or um, you've got teens or you're empty nesters, you're constantly growing and changing in your spouses too. And that means that your marriage is changing. But I think a lot of us kind of just roll with it and just hope like, <laughs> oh, just kind of keep going, it'll be fine. And so um, what we really wanted to do is to offer it um, not only to the couples getting married by us, but to any and all couples, um, just as a resource for free um, to be able for them to, to grow in their marriages too. And um, you know, it's kind of like anything, like, like if you're involved in sports, you practice and you spend time and energy with that, or for your job, you know, you, you put a lot of effort into learning new things so that you can better yourself. But, 
you know, we, we thought, how often do you really spend time on your marriage right. with your partner? Yeah, it's not it's not I do and done. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, right? <laughs> sure. It's an ongoing yeah. thing. So. Absolutely. And so people can go to your website and access all of this for free. Yeah. I mean, is there is there kind of a, a talk you through? Like, I mean, how does that work? No, yeah. It's just yeah. on the tab, yep, yep, under the Black Sheep Shelter. It's the Black Sheep Shelter dot com. Okay. But I'd say marriage and curriculum, man, it's fifty lessons. Kinda of designed, like you can go like one a week to get it done in a year. But a lot of those lessons we recommend books that we were mm -hmm. blessed with and we um, we started really it was just more like exploratory for ourselves. Our marriage is great, so mm -hmm. it wasn't like we need to like dive into it, but we're just really curious and we just want to improve on it and I think the deeper we dug into it, she has an, an MSW, I have MDiv and so we thought we knew a lot. I, mean, I was just humbled <laughs> in the sense of like, oh, you can grow so much. Sure. And there's so many great resources out there. So it's a lot of it's compiling and we're pointing to other people who've said it a lot better than we can. And not to scare anybody, but when you say 50 lessons, these are like one page lessons. They're yeah, they're short. <laughs> <laughs> it does sound a little like daunting, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah, right. So it's like, it's a little like in a nutshell and then it's unpacked and then some exercises too. So it gives some practical ways that people can um, can be able to work through yeah. it. I saw yeah, it kind of reminded me of like a daily devotion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a, yeah. yeah. I mean, exactly. In, in the grand scheme of things, it's not that big of an investment if you're talking about a lifetime of right? happiness, yeah. right? right. <laughs> like your most yes. important bliss, I think you mentioned. Marital wedding bliss. bliss. <laughs> yes. No, well, um. We can get you there, right? Blacksheepshelter.com. There it is. Don't forget the the, okay? The. The Black Sheep, Sheep Shelter. <laughs> Dot com. You want to type all that in. Or if you have any questions, so you can always give them a call. 616-335-0797. Thanks so much for the yeah. time this morning, guys. Thank you, Thank guys. you for having yeah. us.